Hi, this is Technology Insights for Visionaries. Welcome to our new episode. Today, we'll discuss the concept of visual inspection powered by artificial intelligence and its usage for defect detection. This and other episodes are created based on the expertise of MobyDev engineers. For over 10 years in the market, MobyDev team has successfully developed software projects that involve implementation of machine learning, data science, augmented reality, and other cutting-edge technologies. To learn more about MobyDev, visit mobydev.biz. Why should I care about a cool new technology until it's solving any of my problems? That's a logical question product owners ask from time to time. And indeed, artificial intelligence is a trendy term. But how does it apply to solving real-world problems? Let's figure out. Hello, everyone. Today, we'll talk about practical solutions artificial intelligence aims to provide to businesses. One of them is quality control and defect detection. When it comes to describing AI-based defect detection solutions, it's often about some kind of visual inspection technology that bases on deep learning and computer vision. Does it sound familiar? Well, deep learning is an aspect of machine learning technology that's powered by artificial neural networks. The operating principle of deep learning is teaching machines to learn by example. In other words, by providing a neural network with labeled examples of specific types of data, it's possible to extract common patterns between those examples and then transform it into a math equation. This helps to classify future pieces of information. Exactly. With visual inspection technology, integration of deep learning algorithms allows differentiating parts, anomalies, and characters which imitate a human visual inspection while running a computerized system. So what does this mean exactly? Let's use an example. All right. If you were to create a visual inspection software for automotive manufacturing, you should develop a deep learning-based algorithm and train it with examples of defects it must detect. With enough data, the neural network will eventually detect defects without any additional instructions. Deep learning-based visual inspection systems are good at detecting defects that are complex in nature. They not only address complex surfaces and cosmetic flaws, but also generalize and conceptualize the part's surfaces. Got it. But how to integrate an AI visual inspection system? That's a good question. Step one is to state the problem. Visual inspection development often starts with a business and technical analysis. The goal here is to determine what kind of defects the system should detect. Other important questions to ask include, what is the visual inspection system environment? Should the inspection be real-time or deferred? How thoroughly should the visual inspection system detect defects? And should it distinguish them by type? Is there any existing software that integrates the visual inspection feature? Or does it require a development from scratch? How should the system notify the users about detected defects? Should the visual inspection system record defects detection statistics? And the key question, does data for deep learning model development exist, including images of good and bad products and the different types of defects? Data science engineers choose the optimal technical solution and flow to proceed based on the answers they receive. Step two is to gather and prepare the data. Data science engineers must gather and prepare data required to train a future model before deep learning model development starts. For manufacturing processes, it's important to implement IoT data analytics. When talking about visual inspection models, the data is often video records, where images processed by a visual inspection model include video frames. There are several options for data gathering, but the most common are taking an existing video record provided by a client, taking open source video records applicable for defined purposes, and gathering data from scratch according to deep learning model requirements. The most important parameters here are the video record's quality. Higher quality data will lead to more accurate results. Once we gather the data, we prepare it for modeling, clean it, check it for anomalies, and ensure its relevance. Oh, there is a lot to do before we proceed to developing a deep learning model. Yeah, that's true. Developing a deep learning model is the third step. And there are several approaches, depending on the complexity of a task, require delivery time and budget limitations. You may either choose using a deep learning model development service like Google Cloud ML Engine or Amazon ML, or use pre-trained models, or go for developing a deep learning model from scratch. 
More information about each approach is available in the printed version of this episode. Follow the link to the article AI Visual Inspection for Defect Detection at mobydev.biz. Okay, now let's say that we're developing a visual inspection model for quality assessment in buildings. The main focus is to detect defects on the walls. To obtain accurate visual inspection results, we need an extensive data set, as the defect categories might be incredibly diverse. From peeling paint and mold to wall cracks, the optimal approach here would be to develop an instance segmentation-based model from scratch. A pre-trained model approach is also viable in some cases. The next step after developing the visual inspection model is to train it. In this stage, data scientists validate and evaluate the performance and result accuracy of the model. A test data set is useful here. For a visual inspection system, it may be a set of video records that are either outdated or similar to ones we want to process after deployment. And the final step is deployment and improvements. When deploying a visual inspection model, it's important to consider how software and hardware system architectures correspond to a model capacity. Could you go into more detail here? Of course. When we talk about software, the key parameter here is data storage. A visual inspection system involves the storage of video records. The choice of a data storage solution often depends on a deep learning model functionality. For example, if a visual inspection system uses a large data set, the optimal selection may be a cloud streaming service. Speaking of hardware, devices required to integrate visual inspection system may include a camera. And the key camera option is real-time video streaming, a gateway. Both dedicated hardware appliances and software programs work well for a visual inspection system, CPU or GPU. If real-time results are necessary, a GPU would be the better choice than a CPU, as the former boasts a faster processing speed when it comes to image-based deep learning models. A photometer, colorimeter, thermographic camera, and drones are optional. Deep learning models are open to improvement after deployment. A deep learning approach can increase the accuracy of the neural network through the iterative gathering of new data and model retraining. The result is a smarter visual inspection model that learns through increasing the amount of data during operation. Well, this makes sense. Can you bring some use cases of visual inspection? I mean, how it applies to various industries? Sure. Let's start with healthcare. Did you know that in the fight against COVID-19, most airports and border crossings can now check passengers for signs of the disease? Baidu, the large Chinese tech company, developed a large-scale visual inspection system based on artificial intelligence. The system consists of computer vision-based cameras and infrared sensors that predict the temperatures of passengers. Now the technology, operational in Beijing's Qinghe Railway Station, can screen up to 200 people per minute. The AI algorithm detects anyone who has a temperature above 37.3 degrees. Another real-life case is the deep learning-based system developed by the Alibaba company. The system can detect the coronavirus in chest CT scans with 96% accuracy. With access to data from 5,000 COVID-19 cases, the systems perform the tests in 20 seconds. Moreover, it can differentiate between ordinary viral pneumonia and the coronavirus. Wow, that's impressive. Also, Toyota has recently agreed to a $1.3 billion settlement due to the defect that caused cars to accelerate even when drivers attempted to slow down, resulting in six deaths in the U.S. Using the cognitive capabilities of visual inspection systems, like Cognex Vidi, automotive manufacturers can analyze and identify quality issues much more accurately and resolve them before they occur. Speaking about computer equipment manufacturing, Fujitsu Laboratories has been spearheading the development of AI-enabled recognition systems for the electronics industry. They report significant progress in quality, cost, and delivery. For more cases, follow the link in our article, AI Visual Inspection for Defect Detection, in the description of this episode. All right, that's all for today. So let's sum up what we've learned. AI Visual Inspection is based on traditional computer vision methods and human vision. Deep learning model development approach depends on the task, delivery time, and budget limits. Deep learning algorithms detect defects by imitating a human analysis while running a computerized system. The software and hardware should correspond to deep learning model. When initiating a visual inspection, the main question is, what defects should the system detect? 
After deployment, a deep learning model becomes smarter through data accumulation. For more insights about artificial intelligence, deep learning, and data science, we invite you to join MobyDev on social media.